I know you guys have been waiting a long time for this moment. Reveal it, guys. Patrick Star Puppet is the winner! The first thing that went through my mind was like, no way. Like, when they said it and they pulled the cover off the car and I saw my name across the windshield, you know, I just thought they spelled the other competitor's name wrong or something like that. I had to read it through twice in my head and just it took a minute for it to sink in. I just couldn't believe it. I was emotional when they had initially announced it and then when I saw my dad come in and after all the years we spent racing together and all the heartache and all the winning and losing, you know, I, I knew how much it meant to him and to me and it just it was really emotional. We wanted this competition to be the real deal. I think that's evident by all the star power we brought out. Danica Patrick to interview the guys. Mark Martin, Mark Tricks Jr., Clint Boyer, Brian Vickers. I mean, these guys were all seriously interested in who was gonna win the Peak Stock Car Dream Challenge. And that's what's special about it, is we put a full court press on this event, and we found some real talent. I'm really excited to get the opportunity to race with Bill McAnally. I know several drivers that have gone through his program. I know he's got really good equipment from everything Mike was telling me. I got to meet him personally this week and discuss a lot of things that were going on in the competition. And you know, I'm just really excited to go out there and be able to drive one of his cars. My name is Bill McAnally, owner of Bill McAnally Racing. The Peak Stock Car Dream Challenge offers drivers from anywhere the opportunity to become the next possible Sprint Cup driver. And it gives everybody a chance, the hardworking guy that works race to race just to make it out to the track. I think this program gives every driver the opportunity. Well, I'm so confident and happy that Bill McAnally is gonna put his arms around Patrick Sparapoli and give him a shot to race one of his cars. I know it'll be a winning car. Heck, I'm even gonna be in the race that he's gonna debut in. So I'll be right there checking him out all along the way. This is where it gets difficult. This is where your, your name's on the line, everything's on the line. You get that one chance to make a difference, to make a name for yourself, to go out there and put down your best performance with the most amount of pressure. It's possible that the other drivers will think that, you know, maybe he's not qualified enough, and not gonna do a good job. They feel a little jealous that he's there by winning a competition. You know, they might not give him as much time out there. They might bump him around a little bit but what doesn't kill you makes you stronger. If you're good enough, you will stay in the sport and you will continue and all that will deplete and you'll only be better for it. You'll only be stronger for it. You'll only be a better competitor for it. So, go get him, Patrick. But you gotta take this race car, this whole new group of people, go to the racetrack, somehow impress them. Not only that, you gotta impress the fans in the stands. You've gotta, you know, go out there and, and, and beat the competition. You gotta be the total package and oh, by the way, you gotta do it now. It's now or never. I want to wish Patrick Staropoli the best of luck. This is an awesome opportunity. He deserved the opportunity, and I know that he will make the most of the opportunity. We've got the car ready. We've got the team ready. We look forward to developing this young driver. He's shown he's got the talent, and we're excited to bring him to Spokane County Raceway Park for real NASCAR competition on August 24th. Next step is I'm going to get a call from Bill McAnally. We're going to discuss kind of the race schedule coming up, try and test in the car so we can get the thing dialed in. So that, you know, when we make this one race deal, you know, we're going to make it count and hopefully finish up front. The one thing I can tell competitors that want to enter this contest is no matter how small you think your chance is, I mean, if you're really passionate about this sport, you have a dream and you want to follow it, you can put a video out there. They're going to see it. They'll look at it and you'll get the chance to come here and then just go from there. All right, Mr. McAnally, I'm waiting for your call. Let's go win this thing.